Hey guys, it's the loud guys. Today we are going to watch top 20 most beautiful college campuses in USA. So like USA is known for like all the best developing things and the best developing machinery. So now we are going to see the best college campuses in USA because I think so they will be one of the best ones because in India we also have one of the best ones like the IM ones or IIT ones. But I would like to see how they compare to the US ones like how good are the US ones like what kind of facilities they have and like how do they look or do they look too futuristic for what you can think about let's see and seriously indian students are crazy about usa colleges and we have also seen uh you know uh usa colleges in a lot of series and you know they provide uh lockers to students but in india they you know in colleges they uh, basically the college councils do not provide special lockers for you and the you know the in which school I was so uh, you know they used to provide us locker but you used to not you know keep a lot of stuff there you just basically it was uh, small in the size so you just kept the phones or the keys money etc in that locker so I seriously I found uh, that thing very cool about the USA and many there are many students who you know who visited to uh, America for for their further studies and especially to you know to the uh, colleges uh, and uh, in India we saw these kinds of students at gems we uh, we saw uh, we always you know uh, us, uh, always told our uh, children basically parents always compare their children to those people to those children who went to the American colleges so in India if we talk about the status of the American colleges is a very high so yeah I'm also so much excited to watch this video to you know to know further about the American colleges so let's watch the video yes and I'm very excited to see the infrastructure and everything about it so let's watch this video number 20 Scripps College Claremont California Scripps. Scripps College has a beautiful wow. campus that is set in a Mediterranean theme. The school is a liberal arts college for women in a residential area of the city. The grounds span 37 acres and the setting is dotted with buildings that feature a Spanish colonial revival architecture. This looks like a Roman Gordon hotel. Kaufman is the architect yeah. who designed the buildings. The master plan for the grounds was established when the college was founded in 1926. The warm climate offers the ideal setting for kumquat, grapefruit and orange trees and a rose garden is maintained to add a beautiful aesthetic to the grounds. Oh. The Margaret Fowler Garden is also a sight to behold, featuring a Mediterranean wow. style wall fountain and a small pond. Very At 19, Pepperdine University, and Malibu, California. The, the next most so beautiful pretty. college on our list is the prestigious kind of Pepperdine University. The campus sits in the background of one of the most spectacular views of the Pacific Ocean. Just look at the institution the was first founded in 1937 in Los Angeles, but a new campus was built in 1972 with a more aesthetically pleasing environment. It is the main campus is set on an 830-acre parcel with an ocean view and palm trees which give it the wow. feeling of being in the tropics. Ooh, Similar wow, to Scripps, the architecture features a Mediterranean revival design is. with white stucco walls and red tile roofs. Light, Architect William wow. Pereira designed the wow. lovely buildings that reek of charm and dignity. This is life. Pepperdine is one of the that most attractive campuses life. in the United States as well as the world. <laughs> Next up at 18, Rice. Rice University, Houston, Texas. Rice University is a school with a small campus of just 295 acres but it doesn't take a lot of space to create a stunning and beautiful landscape. Ooh. The wooded areas offer a lush green backdrop for the 4,200 shrubs and trees which have been planted in the Lynn R. Lowry Arboretum. This offers an excellent environment for training new botanists in an integrated program that combines the grounds of the school with programs of study. The architecture of the university was constructed in 1911, just one year prior to the establishment and opening of the university. Lovett Hall is a Mediterranean-themed building of stone and brick based on the genius of architect wow. Ralph Adams Cram, along with input from Edgar O'Dell Lovett, this former so faculty member and inaugural Rice president. Wow. Number 17, Cornell oh, University, Itaca, New York. 
From a distant view of the prestigious Cornell University, oh. one can see that the Ivy League institution was set on one of the most advantageous parcels of ground to achieve the most spectacular natural beauty for the surrounding environment. Oh, amazing. The main campus grounds encompass 4,800 acres with densely wooded areas and other trees and shrubbery. The view from East Hill offers a spectacular picture that is frame-worthy. Several of the buildings on campus are listed on the U.S. National Register of Historic Places. So modern, Among the most notable is the Bailey past. Hall, the largest structure with a huge auditorium built in a Greek revival style in 1912. The structure is the design of architect Edward Green, who is also an alum of Cornell. The college was officially founded in 1865. The university sits in a tract of land that was donated by former Senator Ezra Cornell. Then at 16, right. Yale Northern. University, New Yale. Haven, Connecticut. I've heard about this Yale one. University is one of the top three American universities yeah. among the elite class of Ivy League schools. The main campus sits on an 837-acre parcel of land which has been carefully laid out with some of the most sophisticated and richly decorated structures in the area. The architecture is styled in a Gothic revival design and one of the most awe-inspiring among them is the Sterling Memorial Library. Like the architect in charge of design was James Gamble Rogers, who completed the first structures in 1931. The level of intricate detail on the interior and the exterior, along with the reliefs, stained glass window panes and gargoyles, gives the building a one-of-a-kind sensory impact upon admirers. The school was founded in 1701, with its official opening in the New Haven location in 1718 it as Yale so College, receiving the new name Yale University in 1887. Then at 15, Berry College, College, Mount Berry, Georgia. Wow, this looks like a princess house. One of the most sophisticated and beautiful like campuses in the United States is found at Berry College. Oh, oh, oh. The school is set upon a parcel of 27,000 acres of forests, fields, kind of and there is a mountain in the background to complete the natural and spectacular aesthetics <laughs> with stunning <laughs> viewpoints. Although the because environment is breathtaking, the architecture <laughs> of the buildings on the study. campus are sophisticated and dripping with charming magnificence. Wow. Number 14, Princeton. Princeton University, Princeton, New yeah, Jersey. I've also heard about this Princeton uh, University oh. is one of the most magnificent oh. campuses to behold. When you look at the school from the front, you are taken there. with the Gothic architecture of the front of the structure. The buildings are linked together by a grand archway and clock tower with a passageway through the center in an English Gothic theme. The entrance is surrounded by a lush green offering of trees and a terraced portion leading to the front with ample greenery. The interior of the campus grounds features modern buildings designed by a variety of creative geniuses including the Lewis Library by architect Frank Gehry with some of the more noteworthy buildings being the Carl Icahn Laboratory by Raphael Vinoli and Spellman Hall by architect I. M. Pei. Next up at 13, Stanford, Stanford University, oh, Stanford, California. The campus of Stanford Seven. University features the work of architects Frederick Law Olmsted and Shepley, Rutan and Coolidge, which were associates of the late Henry Hobson Richardson. The prestigious institution was deserving of the greatest minds in the architectural world for the design of the campus. The most eye-catching part of the campus is the main quadrangle. It is designed in a California mission style and exudes the sophistication and elegance of one of the most highly regarded institutions of higher education in the United States. Next up at number 12, Kenyon College, Gambia, Ohio. Oh. Kenyon oh College is one of the most beautiful campuses in the country. The small liberal arts school has the aesthetic of ancient stone and it is a historic building. The moment you cast your eyes on the structure, it's as though the wisdom of the age is in contained within the walls. Wow. The campus is not large, but it is certainly one of the most breathtaking, and it has a way of transporting one back in time, simply by taking in the view of the magnificent old-school architecture. Ooh. At number 11, Colgate University, Colgate Hamilton, University. New York. Oh, nice. Colgate University is set in the village of Hamilton. The main campus is set within a serene rural area with a countryside feel. The main structure was built in 1918 and is known as Colgate Memorial Chapel. No details were spared in the intricate design work built into the main building of the campus, with other structures exuding the same yesteryear charm. Wow. Next up at number 10, Flagler College, St. Augustine, wow. Florida. Oh, it looks like a Flagler temple. College is the most yeah. beautiful campus in the state of Florida. 
The institution of higher learning is nothing short of a Spanish Renaissance masterpiece. It was constructed in 1968, originally as the Ponce de Leon Hotel, built for splendor and luxury. See, it was a hotel. Magla College acquired the building and its grounds and transformed it into one of the most breathtaking campuses in the United States. Oh, wow. Number nine, University of Colorado Boulder, Colorado. Colorado. The University of Colorado Boulder is located at the picturesque Rocky Mountains of Colorado. Oh. With such a magnificent backdrop, wow. the university architects were obliged to create structures which would complement the spectacular environment. Near with the, the view mountains. aside, the buildings were styled with sandstone walls and red tiled roofs designed by architect that Charles is Clowder. Breathtaking. In at number eight, University of Virginia oh. in Virginia. Virginia. The University the of Virginia is, is one of the most trees, admired buildings in the United there, States, in part and due to its rich history in our so nation's nicely. past. The architecture like is Jeffersonian in style, conceptualized by founding father Thomas Jefferson. The use of octagonal shapes with white columns and red brick construction offers a significant attraction for both tourists and serious students with an interest in the history of architectural design. In at seven, Furman University, South Carolina. Furman University features Georgian style architecture in the main structures. The bell tower offers an iconic image for guests and students alike. It is further complemented by areas of greenery one. and a lovely Japanese garden. The view of the campus from any angle is what you would expect to see on a postcard or a jigsaw puzzle. <laughs> it's aesthetically captivating. Wow. Wow. At so number six, University of Notre Dame, Indiana. Notre Dame. The University of Notre Dame Ooh. is easily recognized is with its iconic golden dome, which yeah, sits above the main administration building. The original dome was destroyed uh, in a fire, Ryan. but has been rebuilt after the catastrophe. This is yes, one of the, the most iconic landmarks stadium. in the United States, and is home to the Basilica of the Sacred Heart, yeah, featuring the largest that, yeah, collection of 19th century French stained glass on the planet. Next up at number five, Hawaii. University of Hawaii University at Manawa, Hawaii. 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 The University of Hawaii at Manoa is set in one of the most scenic locations in the world. Oh. On the exterior is a lush green alley featuring tropical flowers and palm trees with the beach nearby. The university even owns its own coral reef, which is used by faculty and students for the purpose of marine research, integrated into program curriculum. Wow. Number four now, Bryn Mawr College, Pennsylvania. Bryn Mawr is reputed for its magnificent viewpoints. The school is a small private liberal arts college which has a rich history as a women's only school. It's one of the first institutions of higher education in the country to implement the application of a Gothic architectural style in its design. Oh. The campus encompasses a 135 acre area featuring rows of trees that bloom in a spring and a lovely duck pond. Into the top three now, at three, William and Mary, Williamsburg, Virginia. William and Mary. It William and Mary is one of the oldest college buildings in the United the States. The campus and the school were founded before the United States ever became a country. It was originally founded in the year 1693. 1693. The Wren yeah. Building is the design of the famous British architect Sir so Christopher old. Wren, and it was completed in the year 1700. This campus and its buildings stands as a landmark and a significant piece of the history of the American nation. Oh, wow. Then at number two, Harvard, Harvard. University, yeah. Cambridge, Massachusetts. Yeah. Everybody knows about yeah. it. One of the most beautiful views for Harvard University and is from across the river at nightfall. This spectacular and prestigious institution of higher education is the oldest college in existence in the nation. One of the most striking visuals is the Georgian red brick application for the buildings. These are set around Harvard Yard, and the Carpenter Center for the Visual Arts is Le Corbusier's only work in the USA. Oh, wow. And finally, at number one, Dartmouth, Dartmouth College, Hanover, New Hampshire. Dartmouth. Wow. Dartmouth College is not only one of the more prestigious colleges in the nation and in the world, it is also the most visually appealing. The historic structure, the Baker Berry Library, was built under the inspiration of Independence Hall in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, and architect Robert Venturi gave it a modern addition and upgrade. Dartmouth College is the most beautiful campus in the United States for 2021.
these were actually the best colleges i've ever seen what were these campuses man these were mega campuses and also like <coughs> like we have also like some mega campuses but in there we see some uh, like scare buildings and all and like okay there are some some very nice buildings and there are like i know about a university in dehradun or the mountain area and they look very very awesome but the thing is this uh, many of these are not in a mountainous area or this and that but still they are made so well and also they are covered with trees very well made trees due to that they looks very very beautiful and very very aesthetic and you know whenever you are, are there so there is a chance like uh, if you are studying and you are not studying properly you can just come out and just enjoy the moment and enjoy yeah. the place out there you can just enjoy the university for one or two years then you can start to study that's how the good these university are and i am just i just fell in love with these seriously i also like this video and uh, you know when i watch uh, when i see these uh, kind of university i was so shocked because in india you cannot find these kinds of university it's not like that that the architecture has just made the buildings it's also like they people has also maintained it very nicely and it is so clean and people can uh, basically children can enjoy uh, here a lot and they have big 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 you know uh, playing area they have swimming pool and who's and i do think everybody uh, you know wants to go in such kinds of you know universities and in such kinds of colleges uh, if i talk about you know uh my college so my college is so good but it's not that much good as compared to these colleges and after watching this video i was shocked i was like that yeah i also want to go to these kinds of university it's not like they are only beautiful but also education is very very uh, you know high in these kinds of institution and harvard is so famous in india and most indian students it's not like mostly but uh, students indian students wants to go to the harvard uh, for for the for the for uh, for the study but yeah it's not very easy for the, us indians because we all know that how you know uh how rich the american is america is so it's not like that we uh, we can afford many people cannot afford to go to harvard in india so people basically students prefer and mostly people cannot afford mostly children cannot afford it so they prefer uh, to go to the harvard on uh, on scholarship basis so yeah, i really like this video yes and the thing is like what do what are the college fees and what are the tuition fees of these colleges do let us know in the comment section below so do like share and subscribe Bye. Bye.